Yo guys, welcome to another pack opening on my account. This is a special one, it's very focalized, it's a marquee matchup and we are doing it on the day. So I will be able to show you how did I do every single one of these and it's a very special way because I didn't buy even a single player after the marquee matchups was out. This was super cheap for me. So all this is from, you know, bronze pack method. I had all this in the club. All right, so no, not clear. Submit. So what I did is I watched some marquee matchups predictions. I went to live score. I see what games will come up and what were the derbies. You need to know a little bit of football to, to be able to guess. But if you don't, just look for someone who does predictions or a website or something. Normally they're not too far off. It will tell you like eight possible games. Four of them will be here, which was the case in this scenario, just not the Japanese one. But let's face it, this one was really easy to do. This one was the tricky one. Now, there, there is a guy called Fornal Oroli or something, I can't remember his name. But he's the, from the same club as this guy, so it's the Melbourne, Melbourne City. It's the only gold card between both clubs. So what I did was, I got like 15 of them. Each one of them sold for five, 6,000 coins and I bought it for 350 each card. What a profit, I made more than 100k profit on this. So yeah, if you think in advance, you might be lucky and find this card that will cost a lot. Anyway, all this is done, easy. Atletico Barcelona, what I did for here, oh, I'm missing a player, no problem. There you go, this was really simple as well. What I did was I bought like four, the four cheapest players of Atletico Madrid, Barcelona. I made sure I had some high rated like Andre Gomes, he's not a rare, so he's really cheap. And then I do this every week, I go through every main league and I get as many cards as I can for 350 coins. Some of them will be useful for SBCs, the other ones I can sell again for 400 or 450 and with luck you can sell them for like a thousand or over if they are really needed. So you're prepared anyway. Anyway, yeah, this is done. One rare gold pack. And the last one, pretty much the same as I did for Barcelona Atletico. I got a few of uh, Dortmund, a few of Leipzig. And that is done. Easy, didn't spend a penny. So if you see there, 100 coins, when the Marquis matchups were out, I, had that, I was down to 5,000. All this were four not all I, I sold. So let's see all the rewards you get. Five packs. Pack number one. Let's so hope for a walkout or something awesome. Nothing. As usual, I'll just send everything to the club and then I will trade. Pack number two. And it's... There's the panels. Something big. Spain. Right wing. Oh, Calejón. Not bad. Not bad. We get an Atletico Madrid player. We can sell on. Alright, Calajon wasn't bad, but I want better. So this is the... yeah. I don't care about this one right now. Alright, let's go... let's do this first. Let's sell for a player from Melbourne. That sells for a lot right now. No panels, so the... yeah, no panels. Everyone is a rare though. Ben Arfa! It might be the most expensive 81 in the game. So that is a good pack. Anyone? Well, maybe... What? 5,000? There you go. This is a good pull. 7,000 on just an Australian player. Love it. Alright, the last pack. This is the big one, rare gold pack. Neymar. Ronaldo, Messi. Nope, nothing. Might, uh, might be worth something, not sure. 
Well, and that's everything for today. We didn't get amazing pack luck, but we did it almost for free. Just that player 7000, it probably, it probably was everything together I spent on the players I've used. So one player paid for it all and everything else is free. Calejon, Ben Arfa. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Take my advices for next week. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.